this is a card trick called Lucky 13. Um, I did a review for these cards and I made a slight error. These are actually back on sale. They've been for about a year. But this is one of the original decks um, from 2006. So this is an original. It is still quite rare, but they put these back onto the market now. Anyway, this is Lucky 13. It's a great trick. And anyway, let's go. So I'm going to make a prediction. Uh, let's, what shall I make? Uh, there you go. That's, I've got my prediction. And um, I'm going to put down eight cards. Right, that is eight cards there. Yeah, that's eight cards there. Yeah, that's right. And you're going to tell me a number. So say any number. Uh, Thirteen. Okay, that's a good. Good number. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So that's your card, the 13th card. And also, I'm going to choose a card, but we're going to make this fair. Um, I'm going to have my cards, you're going to have your cards. The so cards that you have, you get rid of. So yours, mine, yours, mine, yours, mine, yours. So get rid of them ones. Yours, mine, yours. So that's my card, that's your card. My card is... A seven, your card is a six. So seven plus six is thirteen. So let's turn over the cards and count thirteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. That's weird, because kings are equivalent to thirteen. Um I made a prediction earlier on. I I did. Oh, let's see what it was. The nine of spades. So, ah, oh, that's weird. Let's see if we. It's an indicator card, so we'll count. We'll spell it out. N I N E O F S P A D E S. So what we have is our indicator card with the 13th card above it. Let's see what it was. Oh, that's quite good. It's a soulmate of the king of diamonds. But not only that, what would a trick be without a little finisher? Also, the other kings. Now, I'll show you the tutorial. It's very simple. Let's see how it's done then. Take the four kings and have the nine of spades as your in your indicator card. You take eight cards, so the five and eight, the ten and three, the four and nine, the seven and six. Set them out like that, so I'll show you that again. So and six. You've got to have two piles that add up to each card, adds up to fades. 7 and 6 is 13, 9 and 4 is 13, 10 and 3 is 13, 8 and 5 is 13. So I'll show you that again. 5 and 8 is 13, 10 and 3 is 13, 4 and 9 is 13, 7 and 6 is 13. And you put one pile on top of the other pile. So this is how it works. In the first card, add the adding to the fifth card is 13 the second card added to the sixth card is 13 the third card added to the seventh card is Phaedra and yep <clears throat> and you will leave them aside for now but we'll need them later now from the bottom of the deck you count down 12 1 2 3 4 5 6 
7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Then you put in one of the Red Kings and then put the other 12 cards on top. Next, you're just going to spell out the nine of spades on the top of the deck. So, N-I-N-E-O-F-S-P-A-D. Then for E, you put um, a black king. For S, you put a red king. And then the card after S, you put another black king. And put the rest of the cards back on top. And now you can bury anywhere in the deck your nine of spades somewhere in the middle and then put your eight cards on top and then you're ready to go so i'm going to make a prediction you look for the nine of spades don't show them your prediction and then you say okay let's choose eight cards one two three four five six seven eight so you put the eight cards on the top and you ask them to choose a number and their lucky number maybe um, they don't want it to be too high, so let's say the lucky number is seven. One, what am I doing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And give the cards a few cuts and whatever. A few little cuts to make it look like the cards are shuffling them, but you're not you're not really altering the position of the cards. So you so you uh, say your lucky number was seven, was it? Let's count seven again. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. Their card is the six. And now you're going to play a little game with them. We say, to find our card, we're going to go your card, my card, your card, my card, your card, my card, your card. And we're going to get rid of your cards. And then we're going to have your card, my card, your card. And their card should be, your card that you choose should be a seven. And it is. And you put the seven face down. You don't show them that's a seven. You put your seven face down there like that. Don't put their cards and the main cards on top of the deck. Don't. <laughs> and turn over to seven. And go that my card's a seven. Your card is six. That adds up to thirteen. So you flip over the deck. Count out thirteen. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Bam. So you go okay. That was quite good. Your card, the, that card, you could have gone to any card, but it was a 13. So you put it there, and you go, okay, well, I made a prediction earlier, let's see what it was. Oh, the 9. Um, that's a bad prediction. Well, actually, no, maybe it's an indicator card. Because if, you know, it's good if you choose a card, you don't want it to work out. It's good if you have a mistake in the card trick to make it look like you have a pub this mistake and anyway you say spell out nine space so n i e o f s p a d e s and you'll have two piles remaining you turn you don't show them the 13 don't tell them the you don't show them the s yet you put it on top of the nine and you go okay well, you could have. Oh, really? You could have chose. Uh, you could land on any card. We could have made. It could have made any number, but it made 13. Kings were 13. Let's see what card we chose. Soulmate to King. But not only that, what's a trick without a little finisher? And it's a great Miss Maggate 2 trick. I think it's brilliantly done. Um, subscribe. PM me, whatever, what you think. Um, if you know any other tricks, tell, comment or leave a message and I'll be sure to get and do them to you. Um, cheers and as per usual, I'll see you next time. Bye for now.